When we talk of the economic planning in the world, first of all, this program was initiated in the year 1928 in USSR. And later on, this was followed by so many other countries of the world who realized that there was a need and importance of such a planning. The planning in India, that is the planning, economic planning in India is done by the central authority which decides the strategy as to how planning is to be done regarding development. This central authority is called as the planning commission and the prime minister of India is the chairman of the planning commission. As I said that USSR is a model to all other plannings in the world. Then USSR planned its economy in such a manner that it is called as the statism economy. That is they had maximum social welfare in mind. That is the people of the country should be happy, prosperous and of course self-reliant. But India did not follow the policy as it was. It of course ensured that there was a planning commission in India. But there is a difference between the planning of India and USSR. In India we do not have the statism but we have the mixed economy. That is both the government and the private enterprises are given equal importance. Besides, our planning is not directive as we have in capitalism, but it is comprehensive planning. That is not only growth in money, but also growth in social welfare. So these are the features of the economic planning in India.